What's up everyone? This is Fink Professional Lunkers. Welcome back to the channel. Man, here we go. 2021 has been great so far and spring is around the corner. Now I have a big announcement as I mentioned in my recent video. If you want to know what the big announcement, you're going to want to stay tuned for this. Welcome back. All right, so I have big news for everybody. Back in 2012 was when I first started video upload. A uh, little bit hunting, a little bit fishing, nothing spectacular. My editing skills sucked. 2020 was a roller coaster ride, a lot of adversities, a lot of bad things we've heard in 2020, especially with COVID. But that didn't stop us from fishing, all right? We continued to go out there in the water and we tried our best we can to continue fishing. And fishing is great because you can keep your social distance from people. So you keep your distance and enjoy nature at the same time and enjoy what you love to do, which is fishing, right? So fishing is just not a sport, but to many individuals like myself, it is a passion. In the last four months, I've been quite busy. I haven't been active on YouTube as well because I've been working behind the scenes plan for 2021. Now, with that going to mind, that didn't mean that I was just gonna throw away YouTube, all right? And I was not gonna desert you guys I was planning to come back. But the thing about it is that if I was gonna come back, I had to come back with big news. And that's why I've been proactively working last year through the National Pro Staff's process. I am now gonna be part of an organization that reached out to me and we've been working with each other behind the scenes. All my videos, never sponsored, but now grateful. I'm fortunate enough, very blessed to be part of this organization. It was about over two years ago when I started throwing glide baits. Now, I really don't ever throw glide baits, but this company is what I wanted to try. And actually, it was my first ex most expensive glide bait. Now, I was like, man, I wanna spend a whole bunch of money in glide baits. I don't wanna cast off $150, $200 lures out there in, in the water. I wanted to throw a glide bait that was gonna help me change the game up because I, as you know, I love throwing luck of punkers. I love throwing top water. I like that reaction bite, right? Especially if it's for bass, stripers, or any other type of species, I like to keep going and keep grinding, right? But one of my friends persuaded me to start throwing glide baits. So I decided to go ahead and throw a glide bait. And I went to tacklewarehouse.com and ordered my first glide bait through there. And that glide bait is the Bait Sanity Ghost Explorer. With that in mind, I'm officially sponsored and part of the team at Bait Sanity Baits. So there you go, guys. That's the big announcement. I just never thought or imagined myself to be part of an organization and to be part of a team and see what they have in store for me. One of the hottest baits back in the days was a Depth 250, right? And everyone was trying to find a Depth 250. I wanted a bait that can glide wide enough especially for the stripers, and that the bait comes with different colors I can choose from, and especially throwing white for stripers, right? Love throwing white for stripers. I don't know what it is, but it feels like it's actually a bait and it's a color that triggers the bite. Matt Allen from Tactical Bassin was talking about the bait sand and he goes explore. Now, and I was like, I wanted a big bait bait. I wanted to see underwater footage. Now, I went to Milliken Fishing and he threw the bait sanity explore in his pool. As soon as I saw that video, of the bait swimming underwater, that was it. He compared, I think it was like five, six different glide baits, but seeing that bait itself, that was it. That was, it sealed the deal. I made my decision. I made the order through tacklewarehouse.com and ordered my first glide bait, and that was it. Since that day, man, I'm hooked, and now I'm part of the team. I love it. No, I do not fish professionally for a living. I have a daytime job. I fish what I can on the weekends as a weekend warrior. If you go through any of my videos from last year, I threw a lot of bait sanity. Now being part of the team, did I get something from bait sanity? Yes, I did. And let's check it out. Boom. Oh man, look at this. All right, so this is a jacket from bait sanity. And you know, it's a little bit cozy jacket and I'm excited. You know, so here we go. Ah. All right, so this is the care package. This is the care package that came through the mail. I'm excited. I haven't seen what's inside here, but I did make an order. It's more than the two baits that I ordered in here. It is a big care package. So let's see what we have. I did not expect to get a care package. I was looking for a small box that I ordered through Bait Sanity because one of the rare colors that they'd have. A new color that they do have now is called the Raw Color, right? The Raw Color Explorer. And I wanted to get my hands on one, and I got lucky. I was able to get on a list. 
Here it is. So this is, uh, man, here we go. These are uh, bait wraps. Wow, these things are huge. Look at this. So if you look at my hand, this is perfect. This is perfect because now I can throw big baits and I can have it wrapped. I think if you go for 16 bucks online, you can find them on tacklewarehouse.com or you can find them at baitsanity.com. They're definitely gonna be using these on my next expedition. Now, I'm planning to go out to do some striper scouting this week and with TDs2 going to mine, I'm gonna be using this on my two big swim bait rods. Why not? Now, what's next? Let's see what else we have in here, right you guys? Boom, here we go. This is the Ghost Explorer. Nine and a half inches. And there it is, man, look at that. Woo, this is a beautiful bait. Now the great thing about these bait sanity baits is that you can change the tails, all right? Now some individuals are like, well, why would you want to change the tails? Well, why not? And you can change the action in the water. Imagine having a glide bait doing something different and the bass and the stripers have never seen before. This is the Ghost Explorer. Now, before we move on, I have a, another announcement. I'm gonna be doing a giveaway of the Ghost Explorer in this video. Now, there's a cast to it though. You have to like, comment, subscribe, and share for a chance to win this bait. Now to win this bait, we have to reach 800 subscribers. If you can reach over 800 subscribers, this bait is gonna go to a special someone. You have to comment below and I'll randomly select a winner. Next bait up, here we go. This is the raw color. This is the raw color. Now, what's the difference in the raw? You can clearly see that the raw is more of a cream colored. It is not white. The Ghost Explorer is more of a white colored. Sorry, I'm not gonna be giving this bait out. I'm gonna be giving this bait out. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. You know, how I throw this bait is, as soon as it's the water, I'm retrieving it in. Because when you hit a splash, I want the fish to already fall already, right? And they're curious because if it's a big fish, as soon as they hit something, they're gonna turn around. It might seem like they might be in flight mode, but they'll come back and do a fight mode. It might come back and figure out what is that big sound. Got a decal, the Bait Sanity decal. Thank you, Bait Sanity. This is gonna go into the boat. I also ordered antidotes as well. One of my favorite colors on the antidote is the trial color. However, I wanted to change the game up. Now, this is a smaller bait. If you've seen any of my videos, as I mentioned, this bait is about, I think, about six or seven inches long. So here's a bait. It's a Bait Sandy Antidote in a perch color. I'm excited. And I bought this in the super slow sink, meaning that it takes a while for it to sink down. Now, the another bait I also got, and I'm curious, is the sardine in the Bait Sandy Antidote as well. This is going to be my first sardine. I have not ordered it before. I've seen it in... Uh, online, but now I finally have one in person. Let's take this out. Let's see what we have in this care package. I want to see what it, I'm curious what it's what it looks like. Oh, look at that. That is a clean bait right there. Beautiful bait. Now this one, I did, I did not get this in the super slow sink. I think they only have it in a slow sink. The difference between the two of uh, the super slow and a slow, I don't think there's much of a difference. The slow sink sinks a little bit more faster than the super slow. But if you're talking about action, I think they both look the same. Now, if you watched any of my videos, the video before, I did mention it that my cousin did catch this monster striper about th over 30 pounds on the bait sanity antidote in a trout color in a super slow sink. You're gonna wanna check that out. And last and not least, I got something else in here. Now, I don't know what this is. Uh, I'm curious what's in here, you know? Um, ooh, whoa, look at that. This is the new paddle tail and the raw color. Oh man, what else we got? Oh, look at that right there. This is the breed hard PVC tail as well. Now, remember I told you on the Explorer, you can change the tail. Why not? You can change the action. Now imagine having a glide bait, just not with a flat tail that is just gliding through. Now imagine having a glide bait that you have a paddle tail and it's paddling through the whole time. Let's see if these two are gonna produce which one's gonna be better or not. Or uh, let's gonna see if there's gonna be a difference. So here we go, another, got another one. Ghost paddle tail, I got the raw paddle tail. Oh man, these are pretty badass. Thank you, Bait Sanity. Last but not least, we have some fins in here that you can also replace. The great thing I mentioned about for the Bait Sanity is that you can change the tail on these, right? You can change the tail on these bad boys. Now, the great thing about us was this new Gen 2, has a clip so this doesn't come off. So what, are, what you're gonna do is that, this is a Gen 2. Now the Gen 1, you did not have this clip on right here, all right? 
this clip on saves it from the tail coming off, all right? And then this light off. And you simply just push a tab, and it comes right off. Now with that, I'll now have a bait with no tail. Ooh, this is something new. I have not tried the paddle tail yet. This is still new to me, guys. So imagine having a glide bait with a paddle tail now. That's trippy, right? Man, this is crazy. What is this? So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna clip it on, clip it on, and slide it down. Oh, there you go. So now you have a glide bait that swims, but it's paddling the whole time. I've watched the ads, I've watched the videos, I've seen it on YouTube and also on the social media of it underwater. But seeing it in person, man, this thing is sick. Why not? So you know what, you guys? Thank you for tuning in. Much love. You guys are the real ones to help me go ahead and be a part of this community. And now I want to go ahead and keep it tuned and bring the content to you. Because you know why? The season has just started. And I've been quite busy because I've been working behind the scenes. But now... We're back to fishing. Enough about that. I'm just going to throw a few clips of all of my big catches that I've caught in the bait sandy so far. There's a few clips that I can include because you have to be subscribed to my OnlyFans account at OnlyFans.com slash Fishalunker. There, I will be going raw. I'll be showing you all my areas. But that's not true. I'm just joking around. I do not have an OnlyFans account. If I did, that might be an idea though. That might be an idea because I, if I did have OnlyFans, I could show you my hotspots and you have to be a subscriber, right? But you gotta pay me monthly though. Uh, I have a shirt off of that. Enough about that, you guys. Thank you very much. And let's continue fishing. I'm gonna see you in the next video. Get ready. Here's two clips that if you also wanna see my recent videos of my catches that I've used at the Bait Sandy Debates, along with other baits that I've recommended. I'll check you guys out soon. Enjoy these videos.